friends i am sunil ranjan and i am an english teacher now in this video session i have come up with a word dam d a m n dam so we pronounce it dam now the meaning so the meaning is it's an exclamation of anger so is exclamation so it is an exclamation of anger annoyance means too annoyed when you say damn or to blame or criticize strongly so when you are criticizing someone or something so you can use this word damn so you have to criticize strongly because then only the flavor of the word comes into picture here now we have the first sentence damn i have spilled coffee down my shirt damn means coffee has spilled over so the person was taking coffee so and the coffee has spilled over so he exclaims and he says damn i have spilled coffee down my shirt so this is the first sentence and the second sentence is turn off the damn tv so there is you notice there is exclamation turn off the damn tv means the person is fed up with watching tv so he is saying turn off the damn tv so now the third sentence is no damn it i was right means the person is trying to prove his point and so he says no damn it i was right so he is telling some other person now the next sentence is they are looking for us damn it means the person looks irritated so he says they are looking for us damn it means he is telling the other person so now the next sentence is he knows damn well how to handle the trouble he knows damn well means now here the meaning is slightly changed so he know he knows damn well means he knows very well so damn well here means very well so he knows damn well how to handle the trouble now the next sentence we have is she is damn lucky she is damn lucky to have got such an opportunity she is damn lucky here also the meaning is the same so she is very very lucky to have got such an opportunity means an opportunity came her way and so the sentence goes she is damn lucky to have got such an opportunity now the sen next sentence is he knows damn all about computers he knows damn all about computers means he knows a lot about computers he knows very much about computers so you notice the meaning and the way i am speaking you are getting the meaning so when you are communicating with anyone when you are talking to anyone so you have to express that in this manner then only the meaning goes to the other person now the next sentence is the officials the officials damn the company for its lack of safety precautions the officials damn the company for its lack of safety precautions means the company had not taken care of safety precautions so the officials criticized the company for not taking care of safety precautions now the next sentence is a uh, very short phrase is damn fool means you are exclaiming uh, to some person maybe your friend damn fool or maybe yourself also so damn fool means Oh, uh, very foolish. Next, and next is damn stupid means very stupid. Damn stupid means very stupid. And the third is damn it means you are extremely irritated. And so you are saying damn it means you don't bloody bother about whatever is happening. So you say damn it. And now the next sentence is oh, it's a damn shame. Oh. it's a damn shame that she cheated you it's a damn shame that she cheated you means a person a man has been cheated by a woman so his friend says uh, 
it's a damn shame uh, it's a damn shame that she cheated you now the next sentence is it's a damn shame he left her now the phrase is the same damn shame so it's a damn shame he left her means a person a man has perhaps divorced his wife so the sentence is it's a damn shame he left her now the next sentence is there's not a damn thing there's not a damn thing you can do about it means you can do nothing about it so there is not a damn thing you can do about it now the next sentence is but who gives a damn what they think anyway but who gives a damn means who cares uh, so that's the meaning that is coming here but who gives a damn what they think anyway so next sentence is he has he hasn't done a damn thing today means he hasn't done anything today so you notice in every exclamation there is some irritation some anger some annoyance so the sentence is uh, he hasn't done a damn thing today and next sentence we have is the novel was damned by the critics the novel was damned by the critics for being too political now damned by the critics means strongly criticized so by the people so the novel was damned by the critics for being too political means the novel was highly political so it was criticized by the people the critics those who criticized are called those who criticize are called critic so now the next is this old car isn't worth a damn this old car isn't worth a damn means this old car has no value it is valueless so the old car isn't worth a damn means there is no value of this old car now the next sentence here is everything up on the shelf everything up on the shelf was so damn expensive means maybe it is moving in the mall because in mall things are mostly expensive so the same goes here the sentence goes here is everything up on the shelf was so damn expensive means very very expensive so the sentence is here now the next sentence is the teacher has been damn decent the teacher has been damn decent with students means the teacher is a kind of compliment about the teacher so the teacher is damn decent with students so he has been damn decent means very nice towards his students now the next sentence is you are damn lucky if you didn't have an accident you are damn lucky if you didn't have an accident means you have been very very lucky if you have not had an accident now the next sentence is she did her job quite well so she is damn relaxed she did her job quite well she, she is damn relaxed means she did her job well so she feels very comfortable now so damn relaxed means very relaxed next one is i just want to make damn sure we finish on time the sentence is i just want to make damn sure we finish on time means i want to be very, very much sure that we finish some work on time next sentence is she knows damn well what you are up to and she doesn't like it she knows damn well what you are up to and she doesn't like it so means she knows very well here the meaning is very well that whatever you are having on your mind she knows it and she doesn't like it and the next sentence is he doesn't give a damn about her means he doesn't care about her so he doesn't give a damn about her and the next sentence is damn you i'm not going to let you bully me me bully me means threaten me uh, so damn you means the person is telling the other person i'm not going to let you bully me means i am not going to let you torture me physically or mentally and the last sentence is let's celebrate and damn the expense let's celebrate and damn the expense 
means let's enjoy and don't bother about the money that is spent here so let's celebrate and damn the expense so my dear friends this is the end of this video and i hope you have understood so if you have subscribed to my channel well nice thank you very much if you haven't do subscribe because then we'll be able to meet again and again thank you